If you take a quick look at this sentence, you can probably tell right away that something is very wrong with it. I'd rather be pissed off than pissed on. That's right. Unless you're texting R. Kelly, that sentence should have a than in it. I'm noticing these words mixed up rather often, and I'm going to give my Facebook friends the benefit of the doubt and assume it's autocorrect's fault. But just in case, let's have a crash course. So there's then, then there's that. The f I'm tired. So there's then, then there's then. Then is usually used when you're comparing things. Bigger than, smarter than, faster than, more competent than, so on and so forth. And then there's then. Then is usually used when there's a sequence of events. For example, he went to his high school reunion, then felt like a major disappointment. His feelings of inadequacy happened as a result of seeing how better off everyone else was, signifying a sequence of events. Here's another example. She kicked ass at Mario Kart, then lost all of her friends. Mel, if you're watching this, please answer my texts. One day, one of my Facebook friends said, I'd rather eat a bag of dicks, then go to Red Lobster. Now, I'm sure he meant then to express his displeasure at the customer service he received there, but I did meet him at Parliament House, so I could be wrong. Here's a little trick I learned back in elementary school. Replacing T with a W. So, if you replace the T with a W and then, it will become when, which is a matter of time, which is when you would use then. There you go, a comparison of time. If you do that with then, it will become... when. Okay, I didn't think that one through. At least the first one makes sense. Okay, pop quiz! I'd rather die, blank wear that. Unless you're leaving specific instructions on what you want to be buried in, you're probably going to want to go with then. I'd rather vanilla, blank chocolate, then. Take both, what the hell is wrong with you, don't be racist. I'd rather ride a horse, blank your mum. Now this is actually a trick question, because the two terms are synonyms, but that's for a later lesson. Splendid! I hope that was somewhat helpful, perhaps for your next term paper or tattoo. And if I see any of you again saying something like, I'd rather stay inside than burn up in the heat, don't be surprised if I take you inside and set you the f*** on fire. Have a lovely day!